Uh, well, hello and welcome. That I am Nathan. Thanks for clicking on the video. I am at Oak Creek Homes here in uh, Abilene, Texas. And now the wind's died down, I might get my introduction done. So I've got this 2,040 square foot, three bedroom, two bath home. Now this is a farmhouse style home. Now let me just tell you, this has got to be the best looking farmhouse styled home that I have ever seen so far. And the floor layout is kind of your traditional farmhouse style layout. But the finishes that they used on this, let me tell you, the cabinets, oh my gosh. If you like hickory cabinets and you, these are the cabinets for you. Like, these are some really good looking cabinets. That master bathroom is, let's just put it this way. I say jaw dropping, I haven't used that one in a while. And where your TV goes, you got a built in wood burning fireplace. So now, as you probably saw on the outside, there's a whole covered area that does not come with the home. Now, it does look really good with the home, though. If you wanted a whole paved covered area out there, that would look really good. But I was going to point out, <laughs> we got the Texas star in your door here. But, you know, it was just so windy and so much noise. I didn't even talk about this flex space that's off to my left here. But look at the size of the tray in this ceiling. Like your whole living room area. So then from your ceiling here, we're just going to come on down this way. Check out that fireplace. You've got real wood burning fireplace, stone hearth and stone mantle. Love the stonework all the way around it. Looks really good. And they went with the same hickory on your built-ins here as they did with all the rest of the cabinets in this home. Now let's just stand back here. Pretend like we're sitting in our couch. Because there's no couch, so I can't really sit. But here we go. It does not look beautiful. All right. <laughs> there we go. And there's that flex space that we'll get to here in just a moment. Now you just wait. Look at that. We're going to start with a teaser there, and now let's come to the island here. Nice big niche right there. Really large center island here. And for your pots and pan stores, let's just count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. <laughs> there is a lot of pots and pans drawers in here. All right, back to the island. 
because you've got this extra large farmhouse sink here. And they used, which brand did they use here? The Frigidaire. So stainless steel Frigidaire appliances in this package. She got a little bit of both for three. That's Whirlpool, that's GE, and that one's Frigidaire. <laughs> so you got it all. But check out this hood. Like this is your perfect chef's kitchen. Fridge is right there for easy access. The kitchen, you got your sink back here and lots of prep space. You've got these great big cupboards right here. And nope, they're not adjustable. So a lot of cupboard space in through here. Now let's just come back over here. Look at that. That is, is that not one of the best looking kitchens you've ever seen? All these floor to ceiling windows essentially. All the way around here. I mean, the entire home is done that way. And this would be your dining room. Now we do have hand laid individual tiles here. So let's see if I can get it. Welcome to your farmhouse. So they're still in the process of decorating this one as you can tell. And if that isn't enough cabinet space for you, you get to come into your utility room here. We've got our locker area. Your freezer space. And a whole wall of cabinets again with a sink. You've got a big set of cabinets above your side-by-side -side washer and dryer. Really nice utility room. Of course, your back door with the full window and blinds. And yes, your water heater has its own space. And then there's our furnace. So as we come through the kitchen, down to this end of the home, we're going to check out our our uh, flex space here slash office. Now this one can be a fourth bedroom. You can do away with this door and just have this as a solid wall and then have just this door with either a barn door or a standard door. And you can leave it as this flex space or make it into your fourth bedroom. Now where that built-in is at is where your closet would be. Of course, they've got lots of decorations and stuff in here. And all of your bedrooms, including your kids' rooms, have these ceiling fans in them. Of course, I suppose when I'm saying all the bedrooms, that does include all the kids' rooms too, right? And now look at how wide your hallway gets. And we've got our study area. And I like that they've put the USB plugs in the study area 
where you're probably going to use them the most. The bathroom is not your standard kids bathroom or guest bathroom. I mean, look how big this counter is. Hello Raiden. You've got the dual sinks, you've got four drawers, you got that same backsplash as in your kitchen. Giant vanity mirror with your recessed lights above each sink. And as you can see in the mirror, you have, now there would be a barn door over this, but this really large linen closet. And then your one piece shower tub combo with the transom window up above you there. And then both your bedrooms are side by side. So each bedroom is gonna get a half of the home so that tells you that they're going to be good sized bedrooms. See, told you, you get a fan in each one of them. <laughs> Something I can't say that I have seen. You usually don't see the fans in the kids rooms. Now I haven't filmed it yet, but I did a walkthrough of a 18 foot wide single wide so the widest single wide you can get in the US and let me tell you it was like super nice and uh, like I said when I film it y'all are really gonna want to check that one out and it was everything in that home was standard and it was like wow <laughs> blew me away they did no options in it so Oak Creek Homes is like really got their game up there. I mean, like I said, you don't see fans in the kids rooms very often. And as I was stating on the outside, wait till you see this master bath. You got just as big a tray ceiling in here in your master bedroom as you do in the living room. And look at the size of this bedroom. So your vanity area here, your dual sinks, this is the exact same setup in here as you had in your guest bathroom. And then you've got this big free floating tub, floor to ceiling windows behind you with the blinds so you can let the light in but uh, close off so that uh, people can't see in of course. Or just make this your backyard. Look at the shower in this thing. Big 40 by 60 shower with the shower tower. And look at how polished that thing is. <laughs> that is some polished chrome there. That's as reflective as the mirror is over there.
So really nice tile in here. And you've got a nice set of cabinets above your toilet area. And it's not just a narrow area, it's a nice big wide area. And then you've got these really nice corner built-ins in your walk-in closet. Now I'm going to open things up for you to go comment down below. What do you think of the home? What kind of changes do you think you might need to make? I mean, you guys like the fireplace. You got the fireplace. You got the really nice hickory cabinets. I mean, you got the four bedrooms technically you could get. I mean, this has got it all. You got the shower tub combo. Really nice kitchen dining room area over there. So let me know in the comments down below. What did you like? What kind of upgrades do you think you'd like to see? While you're down there, don't forget to uh, hit the subscribe button, hit that like button, turn on the notification bell. That way you get notified when I upload videos. I'll be back with some price info in just a moment. Thanks for watching. Well, welcome back. Hope you all enjoyed the uh, haven here. I know this is a really nice home made by Oak Creek Homes in Abilene, Texas. So uh, now we got to get into some price information. But I uh, just want to let you know that uh, like Oak Creek Homes, everything on their lot is uh, pretty much the base models. So for the price that I'm going to give you, that's kind of the base model of their homes. And that's, so I think they do a really good job on their base models. You know, like I said, they're, as you saw by this one here, I mean, that is like really, really nice home for the base model. As I mentioned in that uh, single wide, which there'll be a link to in the description down below, so check that one out. Um, base model, and I was just blown away by it. This one here, just the same. So now we gotta get into the price information. I filmed this home in January of 2023. Um, so the price that I'm giving you though is based off of what's currently listed on the website. So that is as of today. Yes, I'm filming the, or doing this outro in the morning of the day this video is coming out. So anyway, so the, the price that I have for this home has it coming in as shown at $225,000. I shouldn't say as shown, but as listed on the website starting at. So, but these are base models. I hope you all enjoyed it. Make sure you hit the like button, subscribe button, notification bells all right there in that corner right there. And I will see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye.